What is going on everyone? I don't know if you can hear me right now, but we are at Millwood State Park here in Arkansas. As you can see, it's a little bit rainy and a little bit of lightning-y. A little bit of lightning around. lightning -y. But we should have a good weekend this weekend. Uh, it should clear up after the day once the uh, thunderstorms pass. Uh, if we don't float away, we'll, we're going to take some tours and see what's around. This is kind of located around Ashdown, Arkansas. Uh, so, yeah, we're waiting on some friends right now to show up, and we're going to camp with them. They were in the site directly across from ours. So, I don't know if you can see back over there. That's the beginning of their site. So, we, uh, when we booked this, we got a waterfront site. And I don't know if you can see the water line is right over here. That bug likes my mouth. But the water line is right over here. And there's alligators in that water. So, yeah, I don't know how much fishing or walking by the water's edge will do, but there's plenty of other things to do. So hang tight, we're gonna go around and, and see what we can get into this weekend once it clears up. We'll see you soon. over there in uh, uh, southeastern Arkansas mm -hmm. and um, so that came from the Arkansas Post and then we have a uh, Bud Daniels shoemaking equipment it used to have a oh, wow. one a room a room here all the forms and all like that 
And we've got all these kind of tools, a drink box that's got a lot of old bottles in it, the wagon that was taken apart outside, brought inside and reassembled. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. Wow. And now that hearse, the hearse, when we brought it in, we, we didn't have permanent windows at the front, and they had a ramp outside and a ramp inside, and they pulled it over to the front room. But now, then we had permanent windows put in it until the storm came through the other day. Oh, man. And then this is our blacksmith room here. Wow. And we even have a moonshine still. <laughs> oh, cool. Yeah. There's moonshine still. Not current because it's a plastic bucket instead of, you know. And then right here, we actually have a garden that needs some work on it, some tender loving care. But we have strawberries that are fixing to make. Wow. You got, see the little strawberries on them? They haven't grown big enough yet. But Aww. we've got strawberries are growing. It'll be another, maybe a month. You see, there's some little strawberries right there coming on. That is what what you call a refrigerator. You know where you, where you <laughs> keep stuff to keep it cold. Look, you know how Mo calls it the ice box. See, this yeah. is an ice have, box. The ice man would bring a block of ice, and there's a hole right back there in the back. And so you would put stuff you wanted to keep cold in here, down here. See, we pretend like we have our milk in there. But you see that hole in the back? You know what was happening? The ice melts. Then mom or dad would have to call the ice man and say, bring us some more ice. So with that in mind, when you open the refrigerator at home, do you open it, do you just open it like, I don't know what I want. Uh, it's probably uh -huh. on the back uh -huh. back there. Where is it? Uh -huh. Mom, is there anything in here that I can eat? And you just hold it open. You wouldn't do that a long time ago. <laughs> I'd get a hand slap of what would happen. Yeah. <laughs> we are Arkansas 32 Business East. For continuing on miles. Arkansas 32 Business East. <laughs> uh, we are in Ashdown, Arkansas. In case you haven't figured that out, we're staying at Millwood State Park. Yes. Out right outside of Ashdown. So we came into town, as you can see in the video. I don't know if you can see me in the video, but we came we came into town just to kind of tour around and more and more. More and more, more, and more. treasures, yes. antique treasures. Yes. That place was cool. That place was really cool. They had a lot of nice antiques. Yeah. And even, you know, some newer stuff like Fiesta wear and things like that. Fiesta, Fiesta. They had some knife sets too that looked really nice, like good wedding gifts. <laughs> <laughs> but they had some really great uh, antiques in there as well. Even some old, what did you see? Some military clothing? That yeah. was for sale? Yeah, that was pretty people. cool. A lot of Coca-Cola stuff. And they had a whole Coca-Cola section. Super nice people. So if you know anybody that's into collecting Coca-Cola, more and more. More, more, M-O-R-E, and more, M-O-O-R-E. <laughs> Antiques. Antiques. Treasures. <laughs> treasures. Treasures. I believe it's treasures. We'll, we'll get it right. <laughs> and then we walk down to the Two Rivers Museum. Yes. And that was cool. That place was really cool. The, the tour... I don't think, I don't know if she does the tours all the time, but the tour was just amazing. Mm -hmm. All the history of every little thing that's in there is just, that's that's too cool. And not just that, but interacting with the kids and showing them how different things worked. Yeah. Um, you, you don't know. get that in big museums and big towns. Right. And, unless you pay an arm and a leg. Yeah. You know, the, these small towns are just, it's awesome. People need to visit small towns more. It, it, you get an experience like none other. Yeah. In a quarter oh. mile, turn left onto Arkansas 32 East. You're but right, right now we're headed back to take care of Nick the Cooper. <laughs> <laughs> and we will uh, we'll see you back there.
uh, we had a friendly visitor behind our camper. We had a little alligator friend. Um, it was a fun, it was a good campground. It was a fun place for the kids. It was two, were there two different? Two, two playgrounds, two nice playgrounds. Big with slides, multiple slides and swings. So it was nice. One was a little more shaded than the other, I think. We didn't make it to that second one. Yeah, we it had, had a pavilion next to it. We had a pretty terrible storm blow through um, Friday night, but we survived that. Uh, we got to tour a little bit of downtown Ashdown. It's just a good small town that's that's not all the hustle and bustle and busyness. But yeah, it was a good weekend. We met up with some friends and got to hang out and, and did a live stream with Patrick and Patty and Carrie and Russ uh, from Travels with Delaney and with the Road to Rome, and that was good. Uh, but it was a great weekend. Good cell service, yes. full hookups. How much was it a night? That I don't know. Or, we'll, we'll, we'll put it down below. Yeah, we'll, we'll figure that out. <laughs> Anyway, thanks again for uh, coming back to us. Please be sure to like and subscribe, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye.